drop it. saying good morning really because it's fairly early on a Saturday morning good so good morning good morning guys welcome to DMO world if you're brand new to the channel make sure you smash that subscribe button. button hit the notification yeah. bell so, so you, you don't miss out <laughs> well, that went from like zero to a hundred quick didn't it we started off the vlog like calm quiet and then yeah just screaming away here, but well, Aurora is excited. You've got a good reason to be excited, haven't you, today, baby girl? Yeah, now I need to show you. All right, let's 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 go over Aurora and see if she wants to show you something. Let's go over Aurora. It's a surprise, guys! Woo! So what's happening today then, Aurora? It's the baby dinner! Oh my gosh! Wow. Again, yeah, I, I thought this was going to be a nice, calm, mellow start to the vlog, but obviously not, guys. Yeah, as Aurora said, Big up every day! As Aurora said, the day has finally come. It's our gender reveal party. <laughs> Basically, guys, just to break down what happened. Um, so I had this whole party planned out. Yeah, what we we're going to do, we were going to get uh, a marquee in, in our local park. Uh, we're going to get food. We're going to get, obviously, uh, drinks. There's probably about 20 people invited now. Look how the weather turned out, guys. Usual, I'm not gonna moan, I always moan, but it's just usual UK weather, it's raining, so. I told you. Yeah, we had to cancel it, we had to cancel the big party. So we're just having uh, my parents, uh, Sharon's sister, hopefully Sharon's sister's husband, my brother-in-law, and their kids, so it's just gonna be a very small and thing. my um, cousins. Yeah, so we'll, we'll have two of our cousins, so. That's good, yeah, but it's a shame, really. That's all I say. You know, we just couldn't, we, just, we couldn't accommodate too many people in the in the flat because of COVID restrictions and you know, I guess space is an issue. So we just had to do this on a smaller scale. But at least you guys are with us. At least you guys get to see our reaction of whether we're having a boy or a girl. Yeah, boy or a girl. Go, 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 go. Let me, let me just show you guys what we got. I know we kind of touched on it slightly in the last video, but I'll show you what's what's happening. We got, so we got envelope. this envelope here. Pink or blue? Pink or blue, that says what the baby is in this, boy or girl, we don't know. Basically, the place we went to the scan, wrote it down, and put it in this this envelope for us. What's that? I think this here has got some, some pictures from the scan, which we haven't opened or looked at yet, because obviously we don't want to Anything to give it away. Gender. And finally, gender reveal. We've got these cannons, confetti cannons, and we've got no idea whether there's pink or blue in them. Again, it's like the place where the scan just did all of this for us without telling us what it is. So we're going to pop these when, when our guests arrive, and we'll finally get to see whether we're having a boy or a girl. No. As I've said before, it's a bit nerve wracking for me because. Um, <laughs> Mommy, stop. Wait, 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 hang on, hang on, hang on. Did, did you see that, guys? Let's, let's just... What's, what's, what's going on? What <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I am going to bring Sharon in properly to the vlog in a minute. She's just getting ready at the moment, as, you, as you've just seen. Um, but, so today, I find out whether I'm going to have a son or not, period. Because basically we're only going to be having two kids as well. As far as I know, I think we're stopping at two kids. So if it is a girl, I've got to come to terms with the fact that I probably will never have a son. So guys, I don't want, if, if it's a girl, I don't want sympathy. You know, I'm, I, I'm so grateful to have two kids and I'll be so grateful to have a girl. So either way, I'm going to be happy, but yeah, it's going to be, a, I guess a little bit, a bit sweet if it's a girl, because, uh, yeah, it's, it's that moment of realization that I won't be 
probably ever be having a son. But it's going to be amazing for Aurora if it's a girl because she desperately wants a sister. So I know if she's happy, I'm going to be happy. And I'm going to be happy regardless anyway. I'm going to be happy regardless. Uh, I'm just nervous, guys. I'm just nervous, all right? I'm just nervous. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to do. Anyway, let's go tap in with Sharon. Then. Okay, so everyone knows how I feel about this gender reveal. What about you, Aurora? You go first. How are you feeling? Happy. Are you excited? Mwah. Yes. You, you think it's going to be a girl, do you? You're convinced it's a girl? Mm hmm But are you going to be happy if it's a boy? Yes! You will, and you still, you still scream and you still get lit and be excited, yeah? Yeah! How about you, Mama? How are you feeling? Um, I'm just ready to get overdone with just so I can know and start preparing. That's where I am. I just want to prepare. Yeah. So, Mama, mm -hmm. this is the MO, what I want to ask you. So, we're stopping at two kids, right? I'd like to, yes. So, it's not likely we're going to have a third kid after this, so... Does that not like worry you that if it's not a boy, it means you won't ever have a son? You don't worry about that. Hmm. It's 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 more than just the gender for me. It's a, chi it's a child. I'm very yeah. afraid of your um, hair. I, I like the thought of a big family, right? But like I always say, it's the community that we don't really have in, in terms of like our families are spread quite far. You know, sure. so you like to feel like you got backup, right? Yeah, exactly. If I'm gonna have more kids. I like to feel like I can call on someone and say, Ah, can you just come and pick your grandchild or your niece up? And everyone's still working at this time, so so yeah, let's keep trying. And then the next one will be a boy, and then the next one will be a boy. Oh, I'm, I mean, a girl, <laughs> and then Fine. you have like loads of girls. Funny enough, I was talking to I won't say his name, but I was talking to one of my boys about that. He was saying he's got two girls, he's saying. He wants a son, but he doesn't really want a third daughter. It's almost like a gamble. So, so trying for the third one was a gamble. Exactly. It's like if they if they had another daughter, then it's like that's like kind of devastating for them. Obviously, it wouldn't be devastating in the bigger picture, but they they wanted a third child so they could have a boy, and he got his boy. So oh, he did. Yeah. Oh wow. Okay. Goes, if it is a girl. Aurora is just going to have a sister and having that sisterly bond exactly, is going to be amazing for her. Go no. boy. Yeah, and that's, that's, I think that's why I probably don't mind because for me, the, the bond I have with my sister is just, yeah, you can't match a bond that you have with your sister. It's just so nice. You call them, you talk about nothing, just cackle about everything. You said and, cack. And you, <laughs> no, cackle. cackle. You know, and they give you advice, and yeah, it's just someone that you can do life with, you know? If we have a boy, like, I can, like, drip him out, I can buy him the J's, I can buy him, like, all the, like, tracks, matching tracks. Yeah. That's another reason I want a boy, we can just match our swag, we can match our fly. Why do you want to? That's probably why you won't get a boy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll find out soon, anyway. Okay. Got this plain black t-shirt, nothing special there, but... Look at Tommy D in the dress pants. And mine. It's not often you catch me in a pair of slacks like this. And but mine. Yeah. And yours, yeah, your drips. Uh, look, I, I, I have got my slides on with the dress pants. I know that's not, it's probably not a thing, but I'm going to make it a thing. You know, you fashion like, is about, do you, fashion is about doing your, th your own thing, isn't it, right? Do you like more? I love your dress, or I love it. Do you like my shoes? I love your shoes, love everything. They're dress slippers. I just wanted to wear them. Yeah, it's alright, they go with the dress alright, I think. So we're ready, we've got a stand set up so we can record everything. Really nothing special with the demo I'm afraid, guys. That's just blowing up some balloons is the best I can do. And look, look at this little one here. He's just stood outside patiently waiting for a guest to arrive. He's just gonna stand here until everyone arrives. Feel that excited, right, Aurora? Thanks. Don't show my toes, bro. I'm not going to show your toes, bro. <laughs> yeah. I hope you weren't zooming on my butt. I wasn't. If I see on that. I'm just proud of it. I'm proud of you. Just look at you. Go, 
Jalapeno. So, our guests are here. I've got two. Hello. Elsie May, Amelia. Hello. What's it going to be, girl or boy? Uh, I want a boy. You want a boy? And I want a girl. You want a girl, do you? I'm not sure what I want. <laughs> so this is really? this is Aurora's cousin, their first cousin. So this is going yeah. to be their baby cousin. All right. Yeah. We'll see. We're gonna we're gonna find out. Really I really soon. I don't know what I want actually. I would I would rather a boy though because Eli's like the the youngest boy and exactly. he doesn't really have anyone to play with. There's he just always like, has to play with the girls. So on on the, this it. guy's side of the family, it's just girls everywhere. Yeah. So that's another reason I want a boy as well, just to <laughs> just to even it out a bit. Yeah. <laughs> That still won't even it out though. No, it won't. Well, no, it won't even it out. But not, not even it out, but it, yeah. it'll be better. <laughs> it will be better. Let's go and see what everyone else is saying. Uh, girl, girl or boy? Boy. Boy. Yeah. Oh, okay. boy. Okay. That's why I got blue on. All right. Well, that's what you think is going to be. What you want? No, no, I don't mind. As long as it's healthy, I don't mind. It's the need to have a healthy baby. Okay. Wait a minute. We're going. We've got the unwrapping coming up now. Yeah. All right, Dad, go, go or boy? Yeah. What's it gonna be? Girl. Yeah. It's gonna be a girl. Yeah. Uh, look, my hand's shaking already. Yeah. <laughs> Car Carol, girl or boy? Boy. It's gonna be a boy. boy. All right, here we go then. So count, count us down from ten then. Ten. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. They did give us the right colour confetti, yeah, just right. just to be Six, sure. Okay. The envelope doesn't make a bang. Well, if that says a boy, I think you're going to have to go back to the hospital. Which one's right? Let's have a look. Oh, the envelope's been out. We opened the envelope. It's a girl! It's a girl! It's a girl. It's you, got, a girl. you got your baby sister. Alright, see ya. Alright. Mummy, you can protect her. Alright. Well, we're using eight girls now, aren't we? Baby! So, girl! It's a girl. What's up guys, we're just uh, on the sofa, all of our guests have gone, so there you have it, we are having another girl. Another girl. <laughs> Sharon's happy, Aurora's happy, I'm I'm happy guys, I am happy. It's... Why, is it, why are you capping? <laughs> Look, it's, it's, not, it's not that I'm not happy, I'm so grateful to be having another child, like I, I wouldn't change having another child for the world but you guys you guys know how it is I did want a boy and unfortunately I just got to come to terms with it now that I'm probably never going to have a son but anyway it's this not this is supposed to be a day for celebration it's not supposed to be like boohoo poor me or anything <laughs> like that so I'm not gonna look it is what it is God gives you whatever you can handle whatever you can handle and maybe like so I was speaking to my brother-in-law and he said, look, girls, he's got two girls as well, by the way, and he said, having girls humbles you. And that is true. It's Maybe it's like that sort of male pride and that ego in wanting a son and wanting to pass all your manlyhood and uh, your love for sports and all that. And, and maybe... Carry a legacy on. Carry your legacy on, yeah. On. Last night, yeah, there's all of that, but maybe it is just, you know, it's just not meant to be. It's about a healthy baby. Yeah. Happy child. Our child has got a sibling, a sister she can have for life that she can talk to and share little secrets with. Exactly. You know, and I'm I'm happy for that. I'm really, really like I said before, I've got a sister and it's nice that she gets to have that. Yeah, exactly. It's really nice.
this, I, I'm completely outnumbered. I felt outnumbered anyway, just to live in a house with two girls. Now I'm living in a house with three. Like I said to Sharon, what I'm going to do, yeah. Once we once we got our our place with a garden and stuff, I'm going to get the biggest, manliest, most boisterous dog with the biggest set of balls. <laughs> <laughs> Just that I can play rough with, just, I, I like to, I'm, I'm kind of a man's man, guys. That's how I like to think of myself, you know. I like boxing, I like basketball, I like sport, I like. And man's um, man have girls. Yeah, I guess, you t and it takes a real man to raise yeah, a girl as well. Yeah, exactly. I think that's hard. And it's more stress, actually, probably more stressful raising a girl. Oh, he was with the first, with, with the Aurora as well. Oh, yeah. Do you know what? It's weird you say that because, like, that exact same feeling come back to me. That kind of, like, I was disappointed, but I knew deep down I shouldn't be there because it's, like, I'm so blessed to be, like, a daddy and to be able to make babies, you know. It's, mm -hmm. like, it's a blessing. But Exactly. And I know that deep down, but there's just that little part of like, oh, I wanted a son. But at the same time, it's, like, with Aurora, it's not like I wouldn't change her for a boy yeah. for the world. You know, she's, please don't take this wrong. I am so, so happy. Like, when we first found out we were pregnant, I didn't really care, boy or girl. It's just as it crept closer to the the gender reveal date, I just kind of was thinking, yeah, I do. You set yourself up. And I think I, with I, everyone saying, oh, it's a boy, it's a boy, it's a boy, you kind of get your hopes up as well, don't you? Yeah, everyone was saying it's a boy. Yeah. And maybe that's people say it, just telling me what I want to hear. So about the actual big reveal itself. One, two, three. Whee! In your face, in your face, in your face. It's not in your face because it's my daughter. It's my like, it's my second daughter. I'm, I'm happy. Yeah, now you got two daughters. I'm gonna have two look daughters. That. Can you believe it? Two you daughters have, and a wife. That, look at that. Imagine that. Look, you got two girls around you, and then you have another one here. Three girls. You'll mm. be so loved. We'll pamper you. Will you? All right, you well, carry on, carry on. This is on we the record. Look after you. Just. Give you kisses all the time and tell you how handsome you are. Right. Look, see how Aurora is. Aurora is always telling her daddy, Daddy, oh, you look really handsome today. Daddy, you look you look really smart today, didn't you? She said that to you. I literally I love the daddy daughter bond. I love exactly. the bond between me and Aurora, but I just I just wanted best of both worlds. I should be the one that's upset, but Yeah, I guess so. Because I'm never gonna have that mummy dad mummy son. But thank you guys, anyway, for sticking with us. It's been a intense a few weeks, hasn't it? Yeah, it has, yeah. <laughs> but we've got some exciting things coming up. As we said before, it's our 10-year anniversary Woo! next In weekend. So weekend. we're going to be... Elsa's anniversary. Well, let you know where we're going. We'll let you know where we're going, but we've got some good vlogs coming up. We're going to have some very, very good vlogs El coming up. Elsa's we hope you, enjoy you enjoyed our gender reveal. It's pink, it's a girl wasn't what I was hoping for, but I am so, so happy. Like, I'm so grateful I've got these two beautiful girls in my life. And I'm about Three to have... Three girls! <laughs> I'm, about to, I'm about I'm to have happy a... Smile. I am happy, though. I am happy. I'm about to have a third girl in my life. So yeah. pray for me, guys. Pray for me. I've got three girls to keep happy. Uh, We've got this. we got this. i got, got this. You... So we're blessed. We're going to be a family of four. We're going to be a family of... Three girls and one boy. <laughs> we are family. Go I got all my with. sisters with me. Yeah. <laughs> you got all your sisters with me. Girls <laughs> team sisters, win. Girls team win. Girls team win. Yay. Three girls. Oh. And one boy. One man. You look so alike there. <laughs> Car. Daddy that. looks a bit like me. Yeah. It's because you're my daughter. You do. I love you so much, Daddy. Oh, I love you too, baby. And this is what makes it all worth it. Having daughters. That's what I'm saying. You should be happy you'll have that. Look at me, nothing. I get none. You do you can have as much love from me as Daddy. you want, but you don't want that, do you? Daddy. <laughs> Daddy. Yes, baby. It's nice for 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 um uh uh um men to, to have three 
ghost. It is so, nice, really. Nice? Of course. Why do you think it's nice? Because it's loveful. It's it what? Loveful. Loveful. Oh, loveful. It is loveful, isn't it? It is full of love, yeah. Love. Some exciting times coming up, so stick with us for the ride, stick with us for the journey, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Cheers, Cheers mate! mate!